Now you have a picture which is black and white and you want to colorize it. Maybe it's an old image. I'm going to show you how to make black and white picture uh, to be colored. Now it's very simple. I'm going to use Movapi Photo Editor. Now it's very simple. I'll just come after opening the, the app. Just come here. I'm going to drag uh, this picture here. After that, after dragging this picture here, you see the picture is black and white. So what am I going to do? I'm going to come here. You see this icon here? Click restore. Now this picture can restore uh, black and white. This uh, tool, sorry, this tool can restore black and white to color. So I just make sure this one and this one is checked. And then I just click restore. It will give me this. Would you like to resize the photo? Yeah, you can resize the photo. If you resize the photo, if you like to resize the photo, it will take shorter time. So I'll just say yes. Give it a few seconds for it to restore. Now there you have, uh, as you can see, the picture is colored. Now let's compare. This is the picture initially. It was black and white. Now it is colored. Now this is an AI. It uses AI to do uh, that. Now let me put another picture so that I show you more what you can do uh, next. So I'll come here again. Maybe I put this picture here again. I'll discard this one here. Then I'll click here. I'll just make sure you're in uh, this tool called restore. I'll click restore. Uh, I'll just say yes for it to go quickly. But if you want to, uh, to keep the original dimensions, you can just allow it. Now you see this picture. Uh, let me zoom in control uh, plus as you can see there. Now you can add more for it to look more genuine, more colored. You can come here uh, under this retouching. Then you can use this thing called foundation. Now this foundation will give you all the color schemes of I think of human beings as you can see there. Although you can add yours, but these are the basic. Let's say I imagine this lady was uh, maybe this color. I'll come here. I choose the brush size. Maybe I'll start doing what? I'll start painting uh, like that. I just imagine the lady was brownish or uh, that color. I think foundation ladies know something to do with foundation. So I'll just maybe increase the brush size so that we go quickly. As you can see, the, I think this one you see it enhances. Uh, it enhances uh, that. It brings the color. Uh, to be more seen as you can see there so you can do that to enhance the colorization uh, there now that's that I want to show another trick also let's say I put another image this time I put uh, maybe this image here I'll discard this one again now I again I'll come to colorization I'll, I'll click here restore I'll just say yes so that we go faster uh-huh Then after that, it has colorized. I'll just zoom in. Uh, maybe I want this. You see this cloth here, her cloth. I want her cloth to be a certain color. So what will I do? Let me just zoom so that you see it clearly. Maybe up to somewhere there. Like that. Then I want to colorize this cloth here to enhance it. I'll just come again. Uh, now this time I'll go to adjust. Then I'm going to, I'm going to use this brush tool here. I'm going to select specifically this cloth here i'll just play around with the brush size just like that just like that maybe and the softness i'll just do like that i'll undo that if i've uh, gone beyond that i'll just do this uh this and then also this side like that remember i'm just i'm just selecting the the this is the dress i don't know something to do with that the dress like that then i'll just go scroll here come to temperature you see now you can easily change the color of the cloth just by playing around with all this but make it reddish make it even uh, blue i don't know those are the tricks of colorization using mobile photo editor see you in the next video